What's good, Crown Family? We back on the blizzle. Yes, indeed, man. I know it. Listen, I know I tell y'all all the time that I'm about to start vlogging more, but I'm truly about to start vlogging more. I'm currently waiting on sunset right now so I can go film this video outside. I got a dope location that I'm about to take y'all to. Actually, I'm going to take y'all through this whole process of me shooting my music videos by myself. A lot of people don't even know I shoot my videos by myself. I don't have a cameraman. My camera legit be on a tripod. It's just how I shoot it. It makes it look like somebody's... You know behind the camera and helping you but I direct and you know write the script for all of my videos I do it all right now I'm currently until um I think sunset is like close to about I'm gonna go out there about seven o'clock it's like a little open area like downtown area it's really dope I'm, I'm waiting for you know like when the sky get all colorful and everything hopefully we can see it because it's like a lot of clouds outside but right now like I said I'm currently um I'm tapping together this mo uh, this newspaper right here, and I'm gonna uh, draw a whole heart on it. Once I get done, I'm gonna draw a heart on it, and this gonna be like a background once um, I get everything together. But I'm finna get back to doing what I was doing until I uh, get ready to go out there downtown. Um, it's gonna be a really interesting day. So if you're an artist yourself and you want to know how to shoot your videos by yourself. Just watch me, man. I'm going to show y'all some tips, man. Listen, I'm not going to be able to teach y'all everything. I'm not uh, a pro at this. Like, uh, I'm not a professional director or nothing like that. But me as an independent artist, I figured out a way to do this by myself. And I want to help other artists do the same. Okay, I just got done spray painting the broken heart that I was talking about earlier. This is going to be my background. The whole theme in this video is going to be someone that's in their feelings and heartbroken. This is the final look. I'm going to be posted in the corner of this and I'm going to be performing right there. I'm going to put a little bit more newspaper on each side to give it, to make it look fuller. But this is the final look right here. Sometimes you got to DIY your situation and figure it out, man. Hey, like I said. I know a lot of times, hey, you don't have the money for it, the big budget to do these things that you want to. Sometimes you got to think outside of the box and have, you know, think of creative ideas that you can do at home. You know, like I paid like a dollar for the spray paint, you know, like dollar for the newspaper. And that's, that's going to be a fire scene once I get done with it, with the color lights and everything. A lot of times us independent artists don't have the money to pay huge directors to shoot the video, especially when we first started out. That's why I always say, man, figure it out for yourself, man. Use what you got and try to make it work. All right, I just made it to the site where I want to shoot my video. It's like on a balcony. I'm waiting on the sun to go down a little bit because there's too much light coming in. And it's really killing, like, the, the, the vibe that I want. I really want that colorful sky, you know, that sunset around that time. So that's going to be about a good 20, 30 minutes. I just wanted to go ahead and come up here and kind of wait till the sun go down. But hopefully I can get this shot because it's just like, um, I'm not sure if this is like private property or anything like that. I don't see any signs or nothing like that. Um, hopefully I can get this shot before they kick me out. Hopefully. <laughs> Legit, my cameraman, there is no cameraman. There's nobody behind my camera. This is how I do my videos. I sit it on a tripod, hit record on the camera, let the music play and, you know, perform. As I'm about to do right now. Sun has finally went down, as you can see. It's kind of getting that that background that I'm looking for. Let's get straight to it. That right there, ladies and gentlemen, is how you shoot a music video without a cameraman. I'm not done yet. I still got some more scenes to shoot. But can you see this background right now? It's just that that beautiful, beautiful. I think I'm going to get one more shot. One more shot. Okay, I finally made it back home. I'm finna finally shoot the last couple of scenes for the video. I'm going to show y'all a couple of scenes, but I got one scene that I'm not going to show y'all. I'm y'all just going to see that in the video. But I looked at the footage from outside and it looks amazing. I'm definitely getting better with working the camera and working the settings and everything. But y'all remember earlier today when I uh, spray painted the heart. This is how it looks now. As you can see, I'm going to be sitting right there on the pillow. 
in front of this uh, broken heart to give that whole sadness effect. Got the uh, color lights going right here. Got my color light right here. I got this at Home Depot. Uh, Home Depot also, that purple light right there. Cost about $5 and $10 right there. Please don't leave me alone tonight. We got the end of vlog yesterday, but yeah, man, that's pretty much how I um, shoot my music videos by myself with no cameraman, just me, a camera and a tripod. Also, um, the rest is all in um, Final Cut editing, and how I get my like panning shots, like it's on a crane or something like that, I use keyframing. But I don't know enough about that to be able to teach y'all, so just go on youtube look up final cut pro and look up um how to keyframe and from there you can learn how to move the camera and pan and look like somebody holding the camera y'all got more vlogs on the way more behind the scenes i want to take y'all through the process you know i'm an independent artist i don't have that huge budget you gotta do what you gotta do when you're an independent artist you gotta make it work so you know this is definitely one of the ways you can make it work for all of my independent artists that don't have the money to pay a director now if you have the money to do it i, I do say do it because you can get a lot more creative when you got somebody holding the camera and directing you but i do what you gotta do appreciate y'all support we out salute crown family to the next vlog